to Not High, Just Hungry, the cooking show where I create something in the kitchen that sometimes makes people go, Are you high? No! Just incredibly caffeinated. <laughs> and also, very hungry. For those who are new here, a uh, couple things. One, hi, please don't leave. Two, I love mustard. Is love the word? Obsessed. I am obsessed with mustard. For me, it is like the elite condiment. Nothing can top it in my eyes. Earlier this week, I was perusing Pinterest while I was hungry, as you do, and came across this recipe for a spicy mustard. And I thought to myself, I have to try this. But instead of being the weirdo on the internet who just eats spoonfuls of mustard, I figured I need to dip something into this so I can actually try this mustard recipe and see if it has what it takes to be included in my mustard repertoire, if you will. So I thought, why not make some pretzels? The recipe I'm following technically calls for dairy. However, I felt it was in my butthole's best interest to go dairy free. <laughs> You're welcome. First thing you're gonna do is preheat your oven to 450 degrees. Can I do this by hand? <laughs> do you think I have to wash this? Damn it. Two very boring minutes later. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put our uh, choice of dairy into my mixer. Oh man, I'm so excited to use this. To the milk, I'm gonna add my sugar and the yeast. And then we're gonna stir to combine. While we're waiting for our yeast to bloom, I've put a pot of boiling water on the stove behind me and we're gonna bring it to a boil. By looking at our yeast mixture, it has foamed up. So now I'm gonna go ahead and add my flour to the sand mixer along with my salt. Am I supposed to pour the whole thing in here? Now we mix. How do I get this out? We're gonna combine this into a ball. So we're gonna snake these and then plan B. I think I f***ed up, but I have no idea why it's not coming together properly. I'm sure normal people would be really upset by this not working. However, I'm really only just making this so I can try this mustard dip. So I finished all of my pretzel bits now because realistically, these aren't really balls at this point. The water is boiling behind me. Now we're gonna put our baking soda into the water and throw these guys into the pool. We're gonna let them cook for about 20 seconds and then we're gonna take them out and put them on a parchment lined baking tray. And then I don't know, man, just hope for the best. <laughs> I'm going to add my water to my egg whites and I'm gonna mix to combine. Snotty. I've lined my weird dough bite balls on my parchment paper and I'm taking this egg white mixture and I'm coating my balls. I have to say half a cup of egg whites, one egg white would have been great. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this bougie sea salt and I'm going to top my pretzel things with that. Food Network tells me I should be going from high, so hi. Once they're all salted up, you're gonna stick them in the oven for like 10 minutes. While we're waiting, we're gonna make said mustard dip. Here's the thing, after I started getting all my ingredients together, I realized I don't really wanna follow that recipe. So I literally just grabbed a bunch of mustards from my fridge and a couple other condiments and I'm going to mix them all together. I have some yellow prepared mustard. To that, I'm going to add about a tablespoon of ketchup, a little bit of Worcestershire, 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 I gotta look at the thing. Worcestershire, that. We're adding that to this. <laughs> We're gonna add some honey. I know what you're thinking, but Michelle, you're sweet enough. I know, but this isn't. And then I have a honey Dijon, and then just old fashioned Dijon. 
And then we're gonna mix this all together. It's so tangy, but the little sweet. I'm gonna be totally honest with you. They look great. Uh, the color on them is exactly what I wanted. However, they're quite firm. Also hella hot. Wow. The small ones are really tough, but the big ones, they look hella weird, but like soft, hot, <laughs> super pillowy. I'm going ham on the tip. Because <laughs> remember, this is the real reason why this video is being created. Mmm. Mmm. Ultimately, the dip is like 10 out of 10. Create that. I don't really care if you do the pretzels or not. <laughs> Isn't covering your failure with a little bit of success kind of why we do this? I'm definitely going to take the W for this. I don't consider this a loss, um, especially with how good that is. It's just... I'm going to end this on the high note. One more for the road. Thank you.